What is P number? P numbers, P mean parent metal, in ASME section X are provided for users to minimize the numbers of WPS, PQR, and WQT qualifications. The purpose of the ASME weld number tables is to support a numbering system methodology that helps to make welding procedure creation and welding procedure management much easier as well as more affordable. P number is used to group similar base metals, allowing qualification of an entire selection versus qualification of just one. These base metals are grouped by material and assigned P numbers based on what material they are. For example, the P number 1 is assigned to carbon manganese or low carbon steel base metals. What is a number? And numbers are issued by the ASME to group the weld metal deposit for ferrous materials. A complete list of A numbers is specified in BPVC ASME Section 9, Table QW442 as shown below. There are a total of 12 different A numbers specified in ASME Section X. A number with chemical composition can be found in Table QW442. If chemical composition does not match with any A number listed then the chemical composition of weld metal shall be mentioned on PQR and WPS for record. What is F number? The F number grouping of filler metals refers to their similarity on their usability characteristics. The usability determines the ability of a welder to deposit a sound weld metal with a certain filler metal. The F number is essential variable in the most welding process for welding procedure specification and also in welding performance qualifications. Like the P number, the F number designed to reduce the number of procedure qualification and welding performance qualification. The grouping of electrodes and welding rods in table QW432 is based essentially on their usability characteristics, which fundamentally determine the ability of welders to make satisfactory welds with a given filler metal. This grouping is made to reduce the number of welding procedure and performance qualifications, where this can logically be done. The grouping does not imply that base metals or filler metals within a group may be indiscriminately substituted for a metal that was used in the qualification test. This is without consideration of the compatibility of the base and filler metals from the standpoint of metallurgical properties, post-weld heat treatment design and service requirements, and mechanical properties.